Thank you so much, Joanne. And we are back here learning about what type of procedures we can have locally that are not really available anywhere else in central Ontario. We're the first ones. You're the first ones. Not yes. we, I don't have anything to do with it, but you're the first ones to offer this uh, this type of service up here at Lakeview Surgery Center, right? Yes. Yeah. So we talked a little bit about the, um, the lap band, mm -hmm. um, but there's also another type of procedure. Um, tell us about that. Yes, at Lakeview Surgery Center, we have two procedures that restrict portion sizes. They're mm -hmm. very similar in that way. This procedure is for people that are looking to lose between 20 to 60 pounds. Mm -hmm. So we touch on a lot of people's needs here with weight loss. This is a gastric balloon. Yep. It's, re it's regarded as the Jump 6 program because the balloon is inserted in your stomach. It restricts portion sizes and it stays in your stomach for six months. And this is intended to jumpstart your fitness and lifestyle changes. Okay. And so with the restricted portion sizes, we have a dietitian that follows you and makes sure that the portion sizes that you do have are nutrient rich. And what happens after six months? Do you need to have this replaced or does it go away or what no, happens? No, no, we <laughs> remove it. The same okay. way we put it in, we take it out. Okay, now there's a comprehensive approach that comes to this, uh, to working with both of these procedures, and tell us about that. Yes, we believe at Lakeview Surgery Center that weight loss is not just about having the surgery and leaving, and leaving it all up to you. Mm -hmm. What we want to do is support you in all of these changes, and when we do this by having a psychologist, personal trainer, and dietitian to aid you in all of your choices and your lifestyle changes. Mm -hmm. As well, we have small group support available at the surgery center. Now, um, there's a lot of uh, procedures as well, because I mean, you're dealing with someone who has just gone through surgery, but you want to help them uh, learn how to change lifestyle things. So you have yes. a bit of a weight program as well. Yes, yes. At Lakeview Surgery Center, we have um, myself as the personal trainer as well. And what I'm doing with our patients is right now we're working on upper body weight training programs. Mm -hmm. And the reason that we focus on upper body and not the total body quite yet is because they need to lose a certain amount of weight in order to take that tension off of their knees. Okay. A lot of people that have excess weight have joint problems. Mm -hmm. And so what we're gonna do is work with what they can succeed at. Okay. So what we do for- I'll just use this. A few examples, or would you like to do the weight? No, 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 Why you, okay. you, do, you do it. So, I'll do this. <laughs> Go for it. So what we'll do is for the upper body is we'll do like a shoulder press. Okay. And we'll do 10 sets of that, like 10 reps. Yep. And then we do the seated forward mm -hmm. lifts, the side, as well as the back. Okay. And what we want to do is we want to focus a lot on back strength because we do so much at the front and we hold so much, especially women, a weight in the front. Mm -hmm. And so we need to pull our shoulders back, improve that posture, mm -hmm. as well as the self-esteem and airflow, blood flow, all goes along with improved posture. Mm -hmm. So a lot of the exercise that we're doing are in the back, you know, rear deltoid. And you're also seated while you're doing this. And this yes. is also for, you know, the patients as well. Yes, mm -hmm. with their knees and, you know, just to maintain stability and not to put too much pressure on mm -hmm. the joints. In addition to that, we'll do uh, also a seated back pull. Yep. And this is also to strengthen the back and the bicep curls and tricep extensions. We can do them overhead, like so. There's a lot of variation when yeah, it comes to it. But you, so you, ha much. you have to be able to train them and you got to make sure that you're doing it properly. But uh, yes. we're gonna find out the big number when we come back from Lois. Don't go anywhere, more to come on daytime.